today we are out at Narrambeen Lagoon. Uh, you may recognize this is where I filmed the Ecomobile or Ecomobile M20. It has this really nice nine kilometer path, nine-ish kilometers, it goes all the way around. Um, and it's basically mainly limestone, like 90% off-road limestone grass and dirt. So today we're bringing the X-Way Atlas four-wheel drive out and we put on the proper all-terrain tire. So I'm not talking about the, the six-inch street all-terrain with the nice slick tread. We're talking about the, the real off-road uh, seven-inch AT tires. Now these sort of things are not perfectly suited for around the city. Kind of like when you ride a cloud wheel on really smooth concrete, you can feel the bumps. Kind of like a four-wheel drive, driving through the city, you can hear that, that noise. This is what these tires are. They're a really nice all-terrain They've got tread on the sidewall to really help if you're going through deep, uh, steep, uh, soft dirt or mud or grass. It should be quite good. Now we've got nine kilometers. Now with that battery, we should be able to do a loop and then some. So that's enough talking guys. It's X-Way Atlas, four wheel drive, all terrain tires, perfect weather. Now I'm being Lagoon, let's do it. Let's do it. go we are in speed mode 4 we are on 95% battery so not full We're pretty close as I mentioned we've got the all-terrain wheels on and we're gonna see how well this board performs <music> 32 kilometers per hour and uh, feels very smooth. The wheels feel a lot smoother off-road than they do on-road, as I mentioned in my intro. With those knobble, knobbly tires, you do get a bit of um, you get a bit of uh, vibrations on the on the nice sealed road. But on this stuff, it feels like you're uh, on ice. It's lovely. It's very smooth. It's not bumpy at all. So we're going to cruise around here. We're coming up to some footpath now, so I'll cut. We'll go get a coffee and then we'll, uh, we'll do this loop and uh, we'll talk about how the board performs, uh, battery, torque and all that sort of thing. All right, here we go. Now it has been raining here, so I am gonna get quite muddy, I think. Muddy and dirty and sandy, so I feel sorry for the board. So, we're about a K in so far. This is one of my favorite tracks. I've only done it once before and I absolutely loved it on the M20. And so far this one is proving to be a little bit more enjoyable because it's actually a lot quieter. Uh, the M20, even though it's a lot of fun to ride and a good power, you're constantly apologizing. Why well, I'm always constantly apologizing to people because it is so loud. Whereas this one is a lot quieter. Good morning. Morning. My initial ride video watch it it's up here that'll talk about all the specs and the stats I'm not talking about that no, I'm not talking about that on this video today is just the off-road experience on the Atlas with the all-terrain tires I can tell you it, <laughs> it really goes for it
this thing is awesome. It loves the off-road, as you'd expect with those four motors and these nice big knobbly tires. Um, having a nice little, bit, really lots of fun, like slipping and sliding, but controlled. Went through a big thing of mud before and it just pulled me through, like it was, I didn't see it coming. I wasn't filming, unfortunately, I didn't want to do it twice. But the wheels just pulled me through without an issue at all, which was great. Man, this board has <laughs> so much power. It's so good. Side note, this Easter, we went for a drive down and saw our, um, some of our oldest friends. They've just moved into a new house. So we went for the drive down there, about an hour and a half away. Beautiful drive, beautiful house. But the best thing I found out, their daughter, she's 10. She watches all my videos and her dad's a subscriber. So I want to say a big special hello to Sonara. I know she's watching. Right, let's get going, guys. The Atlas, you know what? You know I like it. You know I think it's got a couple of weaknesses as far as the battery and the price. Morning. But the performance is really nice. It's, it's hard to argue with. Oh. <laughs> Man, you know, we're sitting on 32 kilometers per hour here on dirt and steel, and it is a little bit damp. Sorry, a bit of a tight bend there. It's a little bit damp, and this thing is gripping so nicely. 35, 37. It's hard to complain. Once we've done this, I've got a couple of videos to punch out. Really interesting ones. I've got the long range on the Eovan Carbon. That's gonna be a channel record, I have a feeling. We've got a really cool new direct drive board coming. A low cost direct drive with a, a pretty decent battery we're gonna take a look at. And then obviously, we're gonna do the hill climb. We're gonna put this four wheel drive onto the hill climb up against Oh, the Propel, and also the Revil four-wheel drive. That is coming very, very soon. And I think that's gonna be very interesting. Now, I'm really surprised because we have finished that loop. Here is my car. And let's have a look at the battery. Oh, my feet. <laughs> First of all, I've stepped off. Okay, we are on 50% battery. That is supposedly, supposedly a nine kilometer loop. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, 8.8 .8 kilometers and 50%. So like we weren't mucking around there. Whenever, whenever there was a, a gap. Actually, I won't stop it. What we'll do is we'll keep going around this way. I'm not gonna try to do another loop because that would just be silly on 50% but I'm gonna go this way and grab a coffee and then come back. over 10 kilometers been heaps of fun as you'll see from the footage we we didn't take it uh, we didn't take it easy we made it to the beach absolutely beautiful way let me lift you up and show you really nice clean little sets coming through there not many people out 
actually makes me want to go get the, the fish out of the shed and go for a surf. All right, guys, let's end the video there. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, the Atlas with the all-terrain wheels is just, it's what you expect. It's a pleasure to ride. No major surprises. Uh, we got exactly what they quoted for range. Uh, yeah, not much more we need to say, guys. Really happy with this board. Last thing, there is a major change coming to the channel. Something that's going to affect this channel astronomically. Uh, and it's going to be, I'm going to announce it in about four weeks' time. Some of you already know, it's happening very soon. Massive change. It's going to change everything. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. As I always say, skate safe, wear a helmet, and we will see you on the next video.